Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and in another video of things that you should do when you have a new PC. Um, the first videos that I did in this series were to explain uh, things you could do without having to reinstall because for most people the option to reinstall Windows from scratch or a clean install is something that they don't want to do. So the first videos were, let's remove some of the crap that's there. Let's make it more, um, you know, uh, lean and, and, but not have to reinstall windows completely. Now, this is a good thing, but there's even better. And if you do want to try it, then I would recommend when you have a new PC, this is what I do all the time, a new PC. Um, even if you clean stuff and all of that, there's all sorts of crapware that is installed by manufacturers and assistants of all sorts that for most of the time or most uh, cases is completely useless. And, you know, over time as a tech guy, a lot of the extra software the PC makers add are often causing problems. People think it's Windows, but nope, it's the crapware that comes with these PCs that isn't helping. So we talk here of a clean install or at least a reset the PC. Reset the PC for somebody that's not very tech savvy is an easy way to reinstall Windows without having to deal with, you know, downloading Windows 11 or using some media or creating anything special. But I'm going to show you um, that way and I'm going to show you where you can also download Windows 11 if you wish to install it from scratch with some, uh, you know, bootable media. So in Windows 11, the uh, first thing that you could do if you want to try it and really remove everything is simply to go into your settings. In the settings, you'll go to the Windows Update tab. Here, you will have Advanced Options. And finally, here, you will have in the Advanced Options Recovery. What you want to do is reset this PC. Simply click Reset the PC and remove everything. Once you do that, you follow the instructions for downloading an image or for using whatever uh, it's going to ask you. It's pretty easy to do. You just follow the instructions. Make sure that you remove everything. Once that operation is going to be done, you will have Windows 11, nothing else. No crapware from the manufacturer. Nothing is kept. You're really running a copy of Windows and that's it. If So that's the easy way. And of course, for those that aren't uh, faint of heart and that are you know, tech enthusiasts, uh, the best way, of course, will be to simply go to the download page. I'll share the link in the description below where you can actually have the Windows 11 ass installation assistant that will guide you and will help you do a complete reinstall. You can also use the Windows 11 installation media, uh, you can have the media creation tool, and you can also download the image of Windows 11 that you can uh, put on the uh, USB thumb drive where it can be used for a complete reinstall of Windows 11. So this page, the link is in the description below, and uh, that is one of the most effective ways of making sure you have a clean PC when it's brand new without all the crap that manufacturers want to install. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.